so so the analogy that I typically draw is the analogy of athletics. And in athletics, and since we're right here in football season now in, in the U.S., um, two teams play a game on a Thursday night, a Saturday afternoon during the playoffs, a Sunday, or a Monday night. And they play the game, and then they reconvene perhaps a day later, two days later, whenever it is that they come back together. But the last thing they're going to do when they come back together is practice. Hmm. And the person that doesn't know sports would think the first thing they're going to do when they come back together is practice. But practice is not on the radar when they reconvene. Because now we, we, we need to see, well, what does the film say? So they look at the film of the game, but not, but they don't watch it the way we would watch it on television. They're looking at the film relative to breaking it down, dissecting it, analyzing it, critiquing it. What worked? What didn't work? If it didn't work, why didn't it work? If it did work, how did it work? And how do we enhance it? If it didn't work, what adjustments do we need to make? What tweaking do we need to do? What what do we need to purge anything? Do we need to rethink, reimagine, you know, whatever it is, what it is that we did in terms of our game plan for that game, inclusive of whether or not we won or lost the game. So then they'll have a, 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 a justification, a basis for practice because now they've broken down the film and they'll practice the rest of the week, but they'll keep referring back to the film. So the film never becomes irrelevant throughout the course of the week. And then for ultimately it's, it's game day, you know, whether it be Thursday, Sunday, or Monday. So they spent a week, yes, practicing, but yes, engaging in film study.